many of our mobile applications requires calendar element. So in this tutorial we are going to learn how to display and use calendar in our further applications. Hello, welcome to React Pits. Together we will learn to develop modern, robust and beautiful applications. Firstly, I have created a new Flutter project. So let me just remove all of these comments and remove this demo home page completely. We'll create a separate home page widget. So let's remove this. Let's give it a title. Flutter calendar. Let's change this demo to Flutter calendar. So this is what it looks like. The first thing is we need to add a plugin to display calendar. The plugin that I love the most and that has served in many of my use cases is the devil calendar plugin. So in this tutorial we are going to learn to use the devil calendar plugin. So let us install it. We can do that by adding this as dependency in our powerbispec.ml file. So let us copy this line from installing tab and open powerbispec.ml and below the Cupertino icons under dependencies let us add this plugin and let us just hot restart. So first thing we need to do is import this plugin import table calendar right and we need to make this a stateful widget let me close this so that we can see this okay so let's just hot restart as we just change stateless into stateful and we need a calendar controller calendar controller underscore controller and in the init state let us just initialize controller as calendar controller. Now we are ready to use our calendar wizard. So inside this column let us just add a container and let us directly add the table calendar wizard and we need to provide a calendar controller that is underscore controller we just created and again let's hot restart okay so even with the default styles and configurations it is a pretty good calendar okay and we can go to next month previous month and right now we are in the month view we can also change the format by okay week view two week view that is at once it's showing two weeks and then finally a week view okay so this previous and next button based upon the format it goes next month or next two weeks or next week so how do we provide more configurations so let's say let us just change some styling so in order to change some colors and styling let's say we want to change the color of the today today's date we can do that by calendar style it's a calendar style object so today color what do we want today color to be let's say color start orange and next we want to change this selected day color um, let's change the selected color to be theme of context dot primary color okay see 
it's very easy to provide various configurations. Let's say we want to change the today star. If today star is a text style object, so let's provide font bread. Font bread dot bold. Let's make it bold. Let's increase the font size. Let's say eighteen point zero and color color start why so it's very easy we can also provide which calendar formats are available or which one is the initial calendar format so if we want to show only a week calendar we can do that by initial calendar format calendar format dot week by doing this if i hot restart then initially instead of month we can see the week calendar of the current week. We can go even further and customize few many things. So there are lots of available options. So some of the options that I use most is the header style. So header style is a header style object. And it has some other properties. So first thing is center header title. Do we want to center the month and date title? Yeah. So true. Okay. This should center the title. And format button decoration. Format button padding. For format button shows next. Okay. Let's see format button decoration. Let's give it a color orange. Border radius start circular. Let's give it twenty point zero. Let's give format button text style. Let's give color white. See, this is how we can change the format button. Next, other thing is the format button looks confusing because it's showing week, but instead the display is of two weeks. So what I change most often is format button shows next to false, so that format button shows the currently activated. format okay so it's week i go to month i go to two weeks we have lots of other customization options and some more useful options are like starting days day of week so starting day of week is day of week sunday or monday let's make it monday okay. let's do hot restart so now the week starts from monday next is whenever a date is selected we'd like to perform some action so on day selected we get a date and we get a list of events okay whenever a date is selected for now let us just print the date selected date so print to iso string so whenever i select a date that date is displayed in the terminal so i can use this function to do whatever I want with the selected date and we can do the maximum customization with builders All right so builders provide builders is an instance of calendar builder object 
so it provides builder for everything like this day text at the top each day or weekend day holiday outside day that is outside of this week or month selected day okay so let's try using selected day builder so this gets context date and the list of events which will not be using for now and right now let us just return text date dot to string so see the selected day changed like this we want to do some more customization let me wrap this with container and let's make this align let's align center okay looks more like the other widgets let's use color theme of context dot primary color okay it's a square let's use box decoration provide color inside decoration and let's use save box set dot circle okay and let's install this text text style color start white maybe we need a little bit of margin 4.0 okay this looks like what it was there previously but we can customize it however we like we can even customize the today so we can use another builder today builder similarly context date events and you can let's just copy this code and use this okay today and this looks the same let's just change the primary color to power start orange let's just say we would like the square shape with a border radius circular 10.0 hmm. okay so this is how we can use builders there are a lot more other builders in order to change the styling of calendar completely thank you everyone for watching this tutorial if you like the video hit the subscribe button and bell button for more awesome videos like this